master bartender Brian Goodwin is whipping up a batch of bottled cocktails. It's a simple concept. Bottled cocktails essentially are taking a large batch of a specific cocktail and just bottling it up. It's becoming more popular because bars are getting more busy. And like a lot of popular trends, bottled cocktails have deep roots in the past. This is a revamped Prohibition idea. In Prohibition, they didn't necessarily have a big back bar showing off all the bottles. They would bottle up all those Manhattans and martinis. Now they're making their way from the bar to your party, and it's easy to do it yourself. First, you need to gear up. Well, what you're going to need is the bottles themselves, you're going to need the caps, and then you're going to need the bottle capper. Nice and flat. There you oh, go. There we go. Add these chalkboard labels for a nice personal touch. And if you want to keep those labels looking pretty, add a spritz of hairspray. And don't worry about denting that liquor budget. These items are cheaper than a bottle of mid-shelf scotch. Next, one ounce of water on top. Plan ahead. Some cocktails need to be diluted. Anything that you're diluting is typically meant to be enjoyed straight right out of the bottle or just directly into a glass. Anything that you're not diluting, enjoy over ice. Lastly, know the shelf life of your bottled creations. Martinis, Manhattans do very well because they're all spirits. If you have anything with a juice or anything fresh in it, it is going to start to go bad over a period of time. Now you're ready to posh up your party, and the best part? The benefits really are being able to batch up everything and enjoy your own party, but also keep a lot of those special whiskeys and different liqueurs that you have to yourself and not out for everybody else to enjoy. Bottling cocktails at home, it's what's trending.